Hello friends, in this lecture we will learn about Carnot map. In simply it is also called K map. Okay. What is uh, what is the use of Carnot map? Carnot map is used for simplification of a weak Boolean expression. Uh, this is another kind of simplification process suppose there is a mean term say f of a b c and we have mean term 0 2 3 4 5 6 right now uh, for a two uh, two variable Two variable inputs. Uh, the Carnot map will be like this. This number of uh, square. Suppose A and B. Zero, one, two, three. Right. Uh, suppose uh, number of uh, variables. Uh, number of variables. equals to n then number of square will be 2 to the power n so uh, 2 variable means 2 to the power 2 equals to 4 okay uh, number of uh, variables 3 variable say a and b c so number of value 2 to the power 3 equals to 8. So this will be like this. This is for 0, 1. Uh, one thing you must notice, this will be 2, this will be 3, 4, 5, this will be 6, this will be 7. And for 4 variable, this will be A, B. And two to the power four equals to two to the power four equals to sixteen, right? So this will be zero, one, three, two. Four, five, seven, six, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen. Right. So for this, uh, this is a three variable, right? So this uh, will be uh, zero. Uh, in uh, zero uh, square, we, we we had a value one, two, one, three, one, four, one, five, one, six, one. Right. Now we have to group this uh, uh, this uh, ones. How we can group? We can group. Uh, uh, single single uh, uh, variable containing a group 1 2 4 3 like this so uh, if we rebuild re this matrix this will be clear a b c this will be 0, 1, this will be 0, 0, 0, 1, 1, 0, 1, 1. This will be our 0, 1, 3, 2, 4, 5, 
six, six, seven. Okay, so one, 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 and one. So this will be a group. This can be a group containing two variables. This can, can be a group. So, uh, what will be the expression of this? The expression of this first group is this. First group is this. Now, what is the common between these two in A? There is no common. What will be? common between this this is actually b bar c bar let me erase these things okay this will be b bar c bar this will be b bar c this will be b c bar this will be b c and this is a bar this is a so um, this c bar will C bar is the common between these two uh, columns. So C bar plus what is common between these two? A is common and B bar is common. A B bar plus what will be common in between these two square? A bar is common and B is common. A bar. So this is the expression of a big expression. We uh, do a um, mean term expression. This will be a big expression. This is a simplified expression we can uh, derive from the, this Carnot map. Okay. Take another example. Another example. Say, um, take an expression. So y equals to a b c d plus a b bar c bar d bar plus a b bar c plus a b. So what we have to do? We have to uh, derive it uh, in sum of product form. So this will be a b c d plus a b bar c bar d bar plus a b bar c d plus d bar plus a b c plus c bar and d plus d bar right so this expression will be ultimately i am writing this and uh, the ultimate expression this will be a b c d plus a b bar c bar d bar plus a b bar C D plus A B bar C D bar plus A B C D bar plus A B C bar D plus A B C bar D bar. Okay. So if we take the main term expression, this will be eight, ten, eleven, twelve. 13, 14, 15. Okay, so number of variables are 4. So n equals to 4, 2 to the power n equals to 2 to the power 4 equals to 16. So number of squares will be 16. Okay, now take a, b, c, d. So this will be uh, C bar <coughs> sorry C bar D bar this will be C bar D this will be C D bar C D A bar B bar A bar B a b bar a b 
is our 0, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, no, this is not 8, 9, this will be 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, okay, now in 8, there will be 1, in 10, there will be 1, 11, 1, 12, 1, 13, 1, 14, 1, 15, 1, okay, uh, so what will be the um, group, this will be a group containing 4, uh, uh, 4, I mean term, this can be a group, Containing again four term. This is one obviously. And this can be a group. Okay. So uh, by this grouping, we cover all the ones. So we do not uh, uh, regroup like this small groups. Uh, uh, our main motto is to cover all the ones by grouping and all the one are already covered so ultimately this expression will be uh, take this big group uh, column group what will be the common in this axis you can say there is no common in this C D plus take this group this group ok what will be common in this axis we have a common and in this axis we have c common so a c plus uh, the outer group uh, in this we have c common and in this we have b bar common so c, this will be c b bar ok so uh, this is the expression this is the expression, reduced expression of this big expression. Okay, so uh, this is the primary uh, things uh, about the K map. And now, in K map, there are numbers of definitions available. So, first definition is implicant. Okay, this it indicates. indicates the set of all adjacent middle terms the set of all adjacent main terms ok now there is one another definition prime implicant what will be this it is an implicant which is not a subset which is not a subset of another implicant ok now one more uh, definition is essential prime in short we can write EPI and this will be our PI so what will be the definition it is an it is and it is a PI it is a PI which covers means min terms min terms exclusively take example suppose uh, there is a uh, set of main term 
one, two, five, six, seven. Okay. So it contains suppose A B C. Okay, what will be the Carnot map? A B zero. 1 and 4 we have, have written already so there is uh, no need to write again uh, and uh, we cannot uh, write 2 and 3 at a time um, because uh, we have to take optional values so we can take uh, 1 4 and 2 or 1 4 and 3 right take if we take another example say a b c say say zero take example say zero one two five six seven so if we draw a Carnot map, this will be one, 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 this will be one. Okay. So we can take this two grouping, this two grouping, this two grouping, this two grouping. This two grouping this to grouping and this to grouping okay so it will be number one grouping this is number two grouping this is number three grouping this is number four grouping this is number five grouping and this is number six grouping and this is is obviously number one grouping so we can see that uh, all are prime implicants, but essential prime implicant there is no essential prime implicant because all are connected, right? In this example, one and four are not connected, but in this uh, example, all sets are connected, so there is no essential prime implicant. So, uh, mm, uh, what will be the ME minimal expression? We have to take the prime implicant which are not connected uh, mutually. So, what will be uh, 
take one one is not connected with three and five right or this will be two plus four plus six right so this is uh, um, expression through this three definitions Uh, these things always comes in various um, competitive exams so just go through from any books I have given up very short uh, idea of this then we uh, have don't care com combination It is also called non occurring inputs expression. Okay, uh, what, what is that? And uh, we can write like this 0, say 2, 3, 6, 7, and 8, 9, 10. And this is don't care. 8, 10, 11, 15. This don't care expression will help the uh, expression in uh, original wind term expression uh, to group together. So uh, we can see 15 means uh, we have to take say, uh, at least uh, 16 uh, squares, so it will be continued. Uh, it is containing four variable so this will be like this zero one two two three four five six seven eight nine ten eleven twelve 14, 14, 15, right? Now we have in 0, 1, in 2, 1, in 3, 1, in 6, 1, and 7, 1. And we have don't care at 8, D, in 10, D, 11, D, and 12, uh, 15, D. So we can uh, group together like this we can have this outer grouping okay this is one number one grouping we have this grouping number two grouping and we have number three group So, what will be common in this two? This is C bar D bar, C bar D, C D bar, C D, A B bar, A bar B, A B bar, A B. Common in between this two are D bar and between in this two are B bar. So B bar D bar plus in the square grouping we have common A and in between two C bar A C bar plus in this grouping we have nothing common in C D and we have common A B A B. So this is the final expression. What we have, we have uh, these main terms. We can build uh, the expression with the main terms also. But we have some don't care inputs, which helps this main term to group together. Okay. So this is end of this uh, lecture which is called 
the implementation of Cardano Map. In short, K Map. So, thank you.